we're back. Hey. Uh, Boris and Rob show is back today. It's uh, yes. Wednesday. We had an extended Fourth of July weekend. Uh, this is our pre-show show. Hi, Big Sandwich. Hi, Boris. Uh, first of all, congratulations on the show yesterday. I heard oh, great thanks. things about the Meat Sandwich show. Thank you. It was the Meat Sandwich Takeover yesterday. It was. Yeah. So, <laughs> so how, how was it uh, doing the show all by yourself while we were away on vacation? It was a little lonely, but yeah. <laughs> Lonely, just lonely. So it was, no, just, it was good. It was good. It was just emotionally hard for you. Oh, yeah. Otherwise, yeah. it was okay. Uh, it was good. And Bobby Welber was here, so you know, I had fun talking to him. Well, I, th I thought of a new name for like the Meet and Bobby Hour every time we came, like you came into this. Oh, what were some of the names? Uh, the Dream Team, uh, the Meet and Bobby Smile Time Variety Hour. Oh, I like that one. That was my favorite <laughs> <That's> one. <good. laughs> Excellent. All right. Well, good. I'm glad. I'm glad everybody had a good time. Uh, good morning, Gina. Thanks for joining us this morning. I figure a lot of people have off this week. Uh, Probably because it's yeah. Fourth of July week. But uh, I guess a few people will be tuning in this morning. We got a we got a great show. Still recovering from my Fourth of July weekend. I got uh, I got tattooed for the Fourth of July. See that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was up in uh, New Hampshire. Was, right. Uh, spent some time up there and uh, had a, a way too many lobster rolls. <laughs> Uh, got to see some fireworks and hang out at the beach. Very so, cool. So it was nice. Yeah. It was a good time. But it's nice to be back here. Uh, we've got a, a big show this morning. We're talking Legoland with the county executive uh, for Orange County. Steve Newhouse is going to be live in the studio with us this morning. Uh, and, you know, we've been talking about this for a while, this uh, big theme park. There's going to be right. a hotel. There's going to be roller coasters and a water park and the whole thing. Uh, now I'm starting to hear some people grumbling like, uh, you know, they have some concerns now about really? this, about this uh, Legoland. Um, so, uh, we'll see. Are they see. afraid they're going to step on the bricks? Maybe that's what, maybe that's what it is. It's like, I don't want to walk around Goshen, New York and have, uh, Lego bricks. <laughs> I will never be able to walk barefoot in Goshen again. Exactly. Uh, no, we'll find out what some of the concerns are and, uh, what they're going to be doing with, uh, traffic, you know, what, how Route 17 is going to be now that, uh, this Lego land right. is coming, what some of the plans are. So, uh, so we're excited to talk to, uh, Newhouse about that. Uh, hello to Karen and Donald and, uh, Joseph. Yes, that is a, a stick on tattoo, Joseph. <laughs> Have you met me? <laughs> uh, all right, so uh, so we got it. Oh, also, this is very exciting. It's back. Ecto cooler. Yeah, we've we've got our hands on some of the yes. elusive uh, high C ecto cooler. Now, if you remember, this uh, this was released like back in 1987. I don't remember that. I was not born. <laughs> you were not born in 1987. No, no I wasn't. But I know what ecto cooler is. <laughs> This was released in 87. <laughs> After the Ghostbusters movie came out, this was to promote the um, Ghostbusters show, right? cartoon. Yeah. And this became uh, a favorite drink for many kids of the 80s and 90s. Um, and then back in the late 90s, they just quietly discontinued Ecto Cooler. Right. Now, yes, I know it was a weird Ghostbusters tie-in, and it didn't really yeah. make much sense. Because Ghostbusters it, was over for years. But it's so freaking delicious. <laughs> this is like the best juice ever. Uh, and finally, because now there's a, a Ghostbusters reboot, it's back. You're gonna you're gonna open one up. Yeah, have you had this before? You've had this before. You must uh, have. I probably did when I was a kid. You probably did when you were a kid. If you had it, you would have remembered. <laughs> it's green, but it is an orange. Oh God, it brings me right back to my youth. Come on, tell me that's not delicious. It's good. And now, yeah. when I was in college, we used to mix this with rum. That was our uh, our big drink of yeah, choice. Yes, tell me that. So, um, when, uh, when we finally found this in the store, I, the, I immediately brought it home and I mixed up some, uh, some Ecto Cooler and rum for me and my wife. It was like we were back in college all over again. <laughs> it was just as delicious as it was back then. But, uh, we're going to, uh, get the word out this morning as to where you can find Ecto Cooler because it's been in a limited release here in the Hudson Valley. We pretty much bought up all the stock at the, uh, shop right, <laughs> shop right in Poughkeepsie. But if you guys, uh, have seen this on the shelves, let us know, chime in so that we can let the rest of the listeners know who are in the search for uh, Ecto Cooler. And we're also going to give you a heads up on where you can grab some free Ecto Cooler next week, along with some free tickets for the yes. uh, Ghostbusters movie as well. So Very exciting. Be sure to tune in for that. We won't reveal that on the pre-show show. But. Right. Uh, so we got that going on, and uh, I guess we're going to you know, slide back into the uh, the week. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah no, slime cool. back into the week. Slime back. <laughs> You're great. <laughs> what is it? Smile time? Smile time hour? Smile time variety mm -hmm. hour. Mm -hmm. I'm going to wind up drinking all the yeah, we have like two full boxes here, and they're going to be gone by the end oh, of the day. Oh, so good. I am disappointed, though, they don't have the big metal cans. Oh, that's, that's what they used to come in, right? The big high C, the big metal cans, and you have to take the punch, and you punch to both sides, and <laughs> would, would pour it out. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see. Liquid sugar, Richard is calling it. Oh. Yeah, Jungle that's juice. What, that's what it is. Hi, Gina. How are you? Uh, Donald, LOL. Hello, Donald. Mm. All right, so we got all that going on this morning. Uh, also, Robin Taylor is here. 
Yes. She's not here, but she's... She's in the building. She's in there. She's preparing. She's going through her vocal <laughs> warm-ups. Right, her meditation. She's putting on all of her makeup and doing her hair. And she <laughs> has to sit in that chair for hours before the show every morning. Uh, but uh, she's going to do her lost treasure this morning. And I guess uh, her theme is names. Okay, right. So she's going to... I don't know. She's going to play a song for us. So uh, <laughs> we've got that going on, too. And, oh, we're giving away tickets to the Spirit Festival. Uh, yes. Which is going to be happening in Hudson Valley. Um, it's like... Liquor. It's a booze fest. We'll tell you all more about that on the show, too. All right. Boris, you are bringing me back to my youth. Yes, Karen. Cheers to you. <laughs> uh, let's see. Alexander, I'm driving. Alexander Hamilton. Oh, hey. should we? Wait, no, we're not going to sing. Uh, <laughs> I'm driving from Florida to New York right now. I can't wait to listen to you guys up there. Oh, all right, Alexander. You're watching the pre show show on your phone while you're driving? <laughs> Hopefully, someone else is driving, <laughs> Alexander. All right, cool. Well, there you go. We're everywhere. Yes. All right. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you get a chance to listen to the show this morning. We'll be on live starting at 6 o'clock. Thanks.